Here is your update on the tropics as we continue through the 2023 Atlantic hurricane season list. We are tracking three disturbances right now. Two of them both have a 60% chance of development over the next few days. We could see tropical depression formation into the weekend, claiming the fifth and the sixth name off our 2023 Atlantic hurricane season list. The disturbance in the Gulf of Mexico has a 20% chance of development. Slow development is expected as high pressure is continuing to keep that development slow, but into next week as the storm continues to move towards the west, we could see further development and also tropical storm Hillary is impacted portions of southwestern California. So give your family and friends a heads up in that area as we all continue to plan and prepare for the hurricane season. Today we can expect a high of 93 degrees sitting right at average for this time of year. Sunny skies are over the area and rain free weather conditions, but we do remain dry and less humid. So you want to make sure that you're taking taking heed to the burn bands that are in effect across the area and also staying hydrated. We're right at average for this time of year, but it could still be hot out later this afternoon. Remaining through the morning, though, in the low 70s by 10 o'clock in the low 80s before we hit the upper 80s throughout lunchtime and then increasing to our high of 93 degrees throughout the afternoon. You want to crank that AC on high by 12 p.m. today and leave it that way through much of the afternoon. Now tonight we do return turn to a low of in the mid 60s, but heading out the door tomorrow morning is going to be very nice and comfortable before the heat continues to crank up tomorrow. We can expect a high of 98 degrees with those feels like temperatures up to 115 by the weekend. Our feels like temperatures are up to 110 as we deal with more record challenging heat Saturday and Sunday returning to the triple digits. Heat related illnesses are possible and as we continue into next week, that will be the case also. So you want to make sure you continue to practice heat safety, hydrating properly and checking on your friends and family as we continue to deal with the very extremely hot temperatures. Have a great day today.